Can you use ChimeSpot me if your account is negative? Yo, what's up, everyone? Let's talk money. Specifically, let's talk about those pesky negative balances and whether Chime Spot Me can be your financial lifesaver. I know, I know, dealing with negative balances is like a bad dream, right? You wake up, check your account, and BAM. You're in the red. But fear not, financial warriors, because today we're diving deep into the world of Chime Spot Me to see if it can be your knight in shining armor. Now, before we jump into the nitty gritty, let's get one thing straight. Negative balances are no joke. They can lead to overdraft fees, stress, and even damage your credit score. So, it's crucial to understand how to handle them responsibly. That's where Chime Spot Me comes in. But can you really use Spot Me when your account is already negative? I mean, it sounds like a miracle, right? Well, let's break it down. SpotMe is designed to cover overdrafts up to a certain limit, and it's a fee-free service. So, on the surface, it might seem like a magic wand for those negative balance blues. However, there's a catch. SpotMe is meant to cover overdrafts, not existing negative balances. It's like an umbrella that protects you from the rain, but it won't dry you off if you're already soaking wet. So, if your account is already in the red, SpotMe won't magically turn it green. But don't despair. While SpotMe might not be a direct solution for an existing negative balance, it can be a powerful tool to prevent future overdrafts. By understanding how SpotMe works and using it wisely, you can protect yourself from those dreaded overdraft fees. Let's talk about how SpotMe actually works. To qualify for SpotMe, you typically need to have a qualifying direct deposit of $200 or more into your Chime checking account each month. Once you're eligible, you can overdraw your account by a certain amount, depending on your SpotMe limit. The key here is that SpotMe covers overdrafts, not existing negative balances. So, what can you do if you're already in the red? Well, the first step is to figure out why your account is negative. Did you overspend? Did you have unexpected expenses? Once you know the cause, you can start creating a plan to get back on track. One option is to transfer money from another account to cover the negative balance. Another option is to cut back on expenses and create a budget. It might not be the most exciting plan, but it's a necessary step to get your finances back on track. Remember, prevention is key when it comes to overdrafts. By using SpotMe wisely and being mindful of your spending, you can avoid negative balances altogether. And if you do find yourself in the red, don't panic. Take a deep breath, assess the situation, and create a plan to get back on solid financial ground. Now, let's talk about some common questions people have about Chime SpotMe and negative balances. First, can you boost your SpotMe limit if your account is negative? Unfortunately, no. Boosting your spot me limit is based on your account history and other factors, and a negative balance won't help your case. Next, will spot me cover overdrafts if you're already over your limit? Nope. Spot me has a limit, and if you exceed that limit, your transaction will likely be declined. So, it's important to stay within your spot me limit to avoid any surprises. Finally, can you use spot me to cover return payments? Unfortunately, SpotMe doesn't cover return payments. If a payment is returned due to insufficient funds, you'll likely face additional fees. So, it's crucial to avoid return payments whenever possible. To sum it up, Chime SpotMe is a valuable tool for preventing overdrafts, but it's not a magic wand for existing negative balances. If you find yourself in the red, take action to address the underlying issue and avoid future overdrafts. Remember, financial wellness is a journey, not a destination. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time, stay financially fit.